Are you serious? Are you serious, folks? We have a, a, an announcement is being made by the European Astronomical Observatory. It is announcing an unprecedented discovery in space. Matter of fact, according to the announcement from the ESO, scientists working at the observatory have witnessed an astronomical phenomenon an astronomical phenomenon that has never been seen before and the details of this discovery are going to be released next Tuesday, excuse me, next Monday, October the 16th at 10, <coughs> 10 a.m. Eastern. Matter of fact, moments ago, the European Southern Observatory has announced that they have made a revolutionary discovery, one that they will be unveiling to the world on Monday, October 16th at 10 a.m. Eastern, according to the media advisory released today by the European uh, or the e European Space Observatory. Scientists have observed an astronomical phenomenon that has never been witnessed before. But what is it? What? Well, beyond that, no information is available regarding this most recent announcement. The last time that astronomers unveiled a groundbreaking discovery of this nature was when scientists working at LIGO, the Laser Infra for Inframeter Gravitational Wave Observatory, detected gravitational waves, ultimately to find uh, ushered us into a new era and allowing us to see the universe like we've never seen before. Are they going to tell us about the five waves of energy? There's some speculation. Now, if you think back to the days when we, it would, uh, we would talk a lot of times with Mike from around the world, now, we did speak to Mike about two months ago, and he told us that there's going to be uh, information revealed that will shock the world as it relates to the five waves of energy, and that this uh, information, when it comes forward, will be of the utmost importance. There will be no denying that the heavens are shaking and that the earth will be affected by it. I'm wondering if that's what this announcement may be, letting us know in advance that there is going to be significant changes to the earth, to the sun, to our solar system, and is this planet X driven? Because I asked Mike around the world, and you guys know this, I used to, I used to, I interview him now not as frequently because he's so busy since the Trump administration went in and with North Korea and with everything going on. But uh, uh, back in the days when Obama was president and things were a little more quieter, uh, I kept asking, what is the source of the five waves of energy? And he kept referring and dodging and weaving. Finally, one day he said, yes, planet X, planet X is creating the waves of energy. Then I said, but, okay, what do you mean by that? He said, but that's a binary system, planet X. That's all I want to say about it, a binary system. So the question is, are we going to be, are we going to find out about Planet X, Nibiru, on Monday, October 16th? Or are we just going to find out more about the five waves of energy? Or is there some other uh, phenomenon out there that we're going to get, get revealed to us? Well, we're going to have to wait and see. We'll find out Monday morning. So stay tuned. I'll stay on top of the story. And uh, we're certainly living in the days that we never dreamed that we would be in. I want to thank Dan for sending some of this information to me. God bless you guys. I'll see you a little bit later today. Today's live broadcast at 12 noon Eastern at my website. We'll talk about this today at www.paulbegleyprophecy.com. And also everywhere else, including this YouTube channel.